Right, let's go to weather now. Lonnie is out. Vanessa's in. We're looking at a chance for some severe weather tonight. Yeah, it is possible. Damaging wind, maybe even some hail rolling through around the hour of, say, 10 till midnight. And then we have a better chance for more widespread action Wednesday night into Thursday. Let's give you a live look outside. It was a beautiful day for the first day of school at this moment in time. Partly cloudy, 82, the warmest it's been all day, feeling like 84. As we look at what you can expect moving forward, a little cooler tomorrow, 77. Wednesday. Day, the heat and humidity bounce back. We're in the mid 80s. Thursday, Friday, temperatures hover close to 80. And for the long haul this month, we expect temperatures to average above normal. Now, for tonight, there's a 20% chance we're going to deal with that shower or storm rolling through. Tomorrow, pesky shower possible, but nothing to change your plans over. Late Wednesday into Thursday, we've got a strong front rolling through, brings us a better bed of activity. Unsettled still Friday with potential lingering activity into Saturday. Overhead, at the moment, things are nice and quiet, but as we see, we do have this powerful cluster of storms rolling in the southeasterly direction. They're actually flying 50 miles per hour, and you see here in the yellow, that's a severe thunderstorm watch box. There is the potential of severe weather for us here at home. Now, this cluster of storms is riding along this front, which will linger over us through the day tomorrow as well and may spark some of those pesky showers. But here's the activity Wednesday night into Thursday, a more powerful, well-organized front that will be rolling on on through. The latest for you now on Nicholas. Tropical storm sustained winds at 65 miles per hour. Thankfully, forward pace has picked up a bit. North northeast at 12 miles per hour. Landfall expected likely tomorrow early, and it will bring substantial rainfall 6 inches to 12 inches from coastal Texas, even into portions of Louisiana. Let's show you how things look here at home. Overnight, we're watching that cluster of storms. So 10 o'clock, it's rolling through the Garden State, powering through the city, and then evaporating. As it looks right now, as we make our way through the rest of the overnight, still a lingering spotty chance. Tomorrow, a mix of sunshine and clouds with about a 10% chance of a shower. And then again, all eyes will be on the activity that will roll through late Wednesday. So the start of your Wednesday looking fine, but it's going to get hot and steamy. Overnight Wednesday into Thursday, that powerful front rolls through. Tonight, 68 degrees, that shower and thunderstorm risk. Again, potentially severe weather. We'll be on the lookout for damaging wind and even some hail. Your high tomorrow will be cooler. It'll be generally a beautiful day, partly sunny and a stray shower. As we look at the extended forecast, notice how these numbers hover close to that 80 degree mark. Wednesday, the exception mid 80s, late Wednesday to Thursday, some storms Friday chance still Saturday. There's going to be a storm nearby off the coast, so certainly that could uh, bring us some early rain for the weekend. Otherwise, looking fine after. Okay, thank you, Vanessa. Mm -hmm.